Welcome back to the King Films College Football Betting Locks and Prediction Show. And let's start with a recap of last week. We had a great week going 4-2 and two on our picks with the half-unit win for Kentucky and Georgia at the last second cover there. Auburn against Arkansas did not go our way as Auburn came out with a blowout win on the road. Pitt blew the doors off of Virginia Tech and Purdue was able to win outright against Iowa. That was a great call there. Michigan State barely covered against Indiana. That was actually pretty surprising to me. And of course, Nebraska lost by a touchdown against Minnesota on the road. Another surprising result there. In terms of our over-under picks, South Carolina was able to cash this week as they beat Vanderbilt. They cash their over three and a half bet. Moving into this week's locks, we have a loaded slate starting with the Wednesday game, Coastal Carolina on the road at App State. This was the first week that I've ranked them in the King Films Top 25 rankings. Check those out in the top right corner. But Coastal Carolina, we're going to have them minus three and a half against App State. This is by far the closest spread they've had all year. And App State, while they are good, they played Miami close on the road, remember. They're just not in Coastal Carolina's league. While Coastal Carolina hasn't had that adversity really this season, they've gotten away with just blowing every team out. This will probably be their best game and maybe the closest, but I think that they'll just take this one even on the road in blowout fashion as they are a great team. This game will really be a telltale sign of whether Coastal Carolina are frauds or whether they are legit. Next up, we've got Oklahoma State at Iowa State, and I think it's preposterous that uh, Iowa State is favored here. The home field advantage obviously doesn't do much when Iowa already blew them out. Oklahoma State is a great team here. I have them ranked higher than Iowa anyways, and I'm going to take their money line plus 120. Moving for another plus money money line, we're going to have Purdue over Wisconsin. While some may think that they will be on the downward skid after their great upset last week, I think that Wisconsin is just so bad of a team. And Purdue at home, their fans will be wanting to welcome them back and give me Purdue plus 150 money line there. Next up, we've got a shocking play, USC at Notre Dame. This is a rivalry game, and all that needs to happen is the Trojans need to keep it within one possession here, which I think will happen. I think Notre Dame's a bit overrated, obviously. They've come out and played close with a lot of not that great teams. For example, Virginia Tech, and while USC has lost a couple games that they shouldn't have in the Pac-12, but I think they will be able to keep it close even on the road as Notre Dame is just simply overrated this season. Next up, we've got for Georgia Tech, money line plus 220 at Virginia. And I think that Georgia Tech probably should be favored in this game as I think about a lot of these money line plays. But they aren't, so we are going to take advantage here. Give me Georgia Tech to win in this ACC showdown. Next up, we've got Wake Forest in an out-of-conference game, minus three against Army. I think that Wake Forest does a lot better than this Army team. This is an Army team that's coming off a game against Wisconsin. So if Wisconsin turns out to be better than we think, which I don't think they are, I think we have enough data points to assume that Wisconsin is just not a very good team. But if they are, then we could lose two units here. But I think we should have two pretty easy locks in Wake Forest and Purdue this week. Finally, we've got Syracuse and Virginia Tech, and I'm going to have Syracuse plus three and a half. Syracuse has kept it within three points in their last three games, and they have all been losses somehow. I think that they'll win this one outright, but again, against Florida State, we took the money line and they lost by three, so we're going to keep it safe with the plus money here, and they're on the road against a Virginia Tech team that will want to write their losing ways as well. Please be sure to like and subscribe and comment your predictions below.